How you guys doing today is Lamore. Welcome to my channel. Today I have a spooky review for you guys um, as we celebrate the holiday, uh, holiday, the Halloween season. Um, I want to give you guys a review on the Halloween dunks that Nike just uh, released. Um, I actually didn't pick them up on the sneakers app. I went to Nordstrom NYC and they had them there, which is really great because sometimes when you're looking online, you don't really see how the colors will hit because sometimes it looks black, but they're actually gray. Um, and you get to see the actual details of the sneaker. So sometimes on sneakers app, I don't like to order on there because I want to see the shoe in my hand, you know, feel them, look at them and see if I really want them prior to ordering them and then regret like, oh, this, these are not all that, you know. So um, let's get the review started. So. I'm going to start off with the box. The box is original, um, nothing special. Um, it had been really nice if they would have did like a Halloween box for them, even make this all black and then uh, the Nike sign white. That have been amazing or just did some details, you know, that have been really good because, you know, to put someone in the holiday, uh, holiday, the Halloween season and make them feel like spooky and have been great. You know, um, it have been a great way to show the difference between this collection and the other collections that they release. So um, that's a call out for me. I wish uh, Nike would have did a holiday box for them um, for the Halloween season. All right. Uh, so let's open it. Um, no special packaging, like I said before. Um, so these are them. Let me close this back up really quick. So these are the sneakers. Initially, initially, um, I thought that they were black when I saw them in a the picture because some pictures show them as dark. Some of, some of them will show them as light, but they're actually like a cracked gray. If you could see close up, they're like a cracked gray, almost looks like a, like a haunted house. Kind of, it looks like it has like cobwebs on there, which was pretty dope. I liked um, that they made it look like uh, distress. And what I like about distress sneakers as well as as uh, a lot of people is you can beat them up and they'll still look good. You know, it adds character to the shoe. So I was kind of happy that they were distressed because I can beat them up. I can wear them, get them scratched, and they'll add to it as well. Add some character to the shoe. Um, the laces are regular uh gray laces uh they have a glow in the dark insole which i like as well um the nike sign at the back is like heightened where it's like a um what's it called like a glow in the dark so it looks like the nike sign is going up which is dope too so it looks like a spooky or like a flashlight which i like as well so that was pretty dope um the nike sign as well has a glow in the dark right here so when you're walking past the nike sign will look like it's getting bigger which is pretty dope too so i like that about the shoe um i love the front toe box here um they're gonna get a little bit creasing depending on the size i bought a size 13 but i'm usually a size 13 but these fit a little bigger so i wish i would have got a size 12 and a half which they didn't have so um that's another call out for me um, the size runs run a little different because I had FTC Dunks, SB, and I had a 13 in those, and they fit perfect. So I don't know why these fit a little bigger. That was kind of weird to me, but um, it's whatever. You know, I just wear a, a, a thicker socks with them. Uh, the bottom of the shoe, the sole, um, I like as well. It looks like slime green, like a green mix with like some little pebbles in there, so it looks like slime and it looks a little dirty, which I like as well. Um, I was told that these do light up in the dark. I haven't seen that yet, so I don't think that is true. Um, let me know if I got a defective pair because um, these do not light up in the dark. Um, the hologram right here or the, the glow in the dark Nike swoosh lights up and the back lights up, but I haven't seen the soul um, or the bottom gums light up on the shoe. I know most Halloween dunks have the light up uh, bottom sole, which I love, and I thought this will have them, and that's the reason why I bought them. Um, so I don't know if my lighting is off or I'm not doing it properly where I'm walking and checking. I'll have to ask some more people, but these definitely don't light up 
um, when you walk, which I wanted the most, you know, that was the main reason why I got the shoe, you know, because I never bought a pair of Halloween dunks before Halloween sneakers from Nike. And I really wanted one, you know, I feel like I like the the holiday and I wanted one to, you know, represent every uh, Halloween season. I'll wear them. And as like five years pass along, you'll still have these. I'm like, oh, I wore these in the 2022 um, seasons, you know, so they're really dope and nostalgic. So I really wanted that glow in the dark um, soul. So hopefully um, I'm just not doing it right and it still has it, you know, because that's a bit bit of a letdown from Nike if they didn't make the bottom sole uh, glow in the dark, you know. But overall, the shoe is really nice. The colorway is nice. Um, you could wear these with multiple outfits. I'm going to wear these with my Izzy Niaki pants in black. I'm going to wear all black mainly with this. I might wear a little bit of white, but I think I'm going to really do all black because I think it will match the outfit a little bit more. So, um, yeah, that's all I have for you today when it comes to the Halloween dunks. Um, they're not too, too special. They didn't do too much on them, which is really cool because you can wear them after the Halloween season. They're not like having a bunch of um, like uh, designs on them, you know, so it's like you only can wear it for the holiday se um, the ho uh, Halloween season. You can wear them and for Christmas if you want to, you know, so that's pretty dope that they have um, wearable, um, more, it's more wearable than the other Halloween dunks. So I thought that was pretty cool as well. So that's a review I have for you guys today. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. Do you have these? Do yours glow in the dark? Let me know if I'm not doing it right or if I'm, um, I misinterpret what they were selling, you know, because I really thought the bottom did glow in the dark. Um, so let me know in the comments what you guys think and give this video a thumbs up if you like it and subscribe for more. All right. Peace.